I've been reading in the book of Ephesians for my quiet times with the Lord the past few days. And um, one thing that's re really standing out to me is how much um, Paul, in writing this letter, it keeps reminding them of where they were um, outside of Christ and um, living in sin and following the desires of their flesh and then and then reminding them what Christ Jesus did for them and in, in dying on the cross for their sins so that he could set them free and um, so Ephesians 1 through to chapter 3 is basically um, presenting this case for living for Christ and because of what Jesus did for us and then he begins chapter 4 and says therefore you know I urge you then to live a life worthy of the calling you have received and then he goes on to, to explain how to, how to do that and um, this is one of my favorite chapters in the Bible because um, it's talking about how uh, we need to put off the old man, the old life, the old um, person that we were and how we need to be transformed in our thinking and our minds and we need to put on the new self created to be like God in true righteousness and holiness and that's that's what the Christian life is all about it's not just getting saved so we can go to heaven one day to be with Jesus and just live our lives however we want to while we're here on this earth but it's about um, living for him here and, and the, the things that he did for us appropriating them to our, our daily lives so that we walk in obedience and fellowship with our Lord you know and live for him and obey him and that's what this song is about Eternity 